My name is Dwayne Brennan with ABS Technology Architects. I'm a senior network architect. We've got offices in Virginia Beach, Roanoke, and Richmond. We're headquartered here in Virginia Beach area. And we're roughly about 100 employees now. We have a strong focus in the small to medium-sized uh, market space and have structured an organization to be able to support that. At the same time, we have a really keen understanding of what the enterprise customer has and can bring a lot of that touch and feel that we provide to a small and medium-sized customer to a large organization. As an account manager with ABS, it's, it's my privilege to be able to kind of focus on the healthcare and education space. And it's really neat to be able to come to work, provide effective solutions to our customers that have an impact, uh, not just on their business, uh, but on our society at large. The culture at ABS is really unique in that they've done a good job striving to keep it as a family-oriented type business. So the priorities here are not so much all the time finding the right technician or engineer or so on and so forth, but more importantly, finding somebody that meets with that culture, that has the attitude and the, the push and the drive to fit in. Um, we find that as more of a priority. People can be molded and trained to do what they need to, technically or sales-wise or whatever that background may need to be. But the piece that you can't change is personality, and that's kind of been the big driving force here. ABS has been aligned with Cisco since the late 90s, and uh, as a result of that, we've grown in our relationship so that we really have a good understanding of Cisco's goals, objectives, alignment in the marketplace, and we can support that for the benefit of our customers in implementation and architecture. ABS is uh, proud and honored to have attained the Master Specialization in UC. What that really means for us is, one, it's a reflection of the hard work and strong partnership that ABS has with Cisco around the unified collaboration and communication space. Uh, and more importantly, it says to our customers that we have the ability at a world-class level to allow them to continue uh, down this very exciting road of collaboration. In achieving that UC Masters for the collaboration specialization, uh, ABS has actually become one of the few in that elite ring of people that actually has that specialization in the area now. That's important to our customers because it shows that we've got a vested time and interest in it, right? So instead of just pushing out that there is this technology and that it can do that, we actually have a roaming van that we can use to do demos, so we can actually prove and show that it works, and it's really tried and true. The ABS ATV, our advanced technology vehicle, really allows us to bring the technology to our customers, and we do that in a lot of different ways. We show up at shows and at customer sites to, in some ways, sell the technology, but we also use it to serve uh, and give back a little bit. For instance, at one of my higher ed customers, we were able to bring the ATV out and allow students to come through and experience firsthand a lot of the new technologies that are uh, coming into the marketplace, which is really not something they would be exposed to in their uh, typical classroom environment. Where ABS is today is uh, is truly something that gives me chill bumps. Uh, you know, I started with ABS several years ago. Uh, we were a kind of a small, growing organization, and in that uh, short period of time. Uh, the acceleration of our ability to deliver for our customers uh, has been uh, nothing short of breathtaking. Having been with ABS for a number of years, I'm incredibly excited about where we're going right now. When we started here, it was a little bit smaller. We're really putting all of the dedication and the effort into what we need to do to really become a true enterprise vendor. We're at that level now, but we're just bettering it as we go. 